while the Mercer Baseball Bears off to a strong start in 2023, five and one. And after a strong start to this weekend with Friday night's win over Rhode Island today, Mercer going for the series win against Rhodey at Ortho Georgia Park. Bottom of the first, Bears waste no time getting it going. Traffic on the bases. Reed Brown stays hot into left field. Here comes Joseph Rohrbacher that makes it one nothing Bears. However, Mercer cannot add on anymore. Check out the Bears starter on the bump today, Ryan Lobis for the Bears. Third inning with two away. Got him, Rilo fired up and he gets out of the jam. But the Rams, oh, they were not going anywhere today. One inning later, they'll get to Lobis. Michael Anderson golfs one into no man's land. That's going to get down. One run scores easily. Here comes another. There's a collision at home plate, but luckily catcher Carter Sanford is okay. What's not okay is that Rhode Island has a 2-1 lead. So Lobis gets chased out of the game. Who replaces him? That guy, making Georgia's own Micah Takis. Batter number one, he froze him. Strikeout. How about another? Got him with the high cheese. Takis gets back-to-back -back strikeouts, and he would get out of the inning, preventing further damage. Same score in the bottom of the fifth. Could the sixth-year shortstop Trevor Austin get it going for the Bears? Well, he sends this ball a long way out to right field, but how about the nice over-the-shoulder grab by Billy Butler up against the wall? And Austin, yeah, just going to give him the, the tip of the cap. Not much more you can do about that. Just a good catch. Just that kind of day for the Bears. Rhode Island wins game two of the series. The rubber match tomorrow at Ortho Georgia Park, bright and early at 11 a.m.